Hi everybody, welcome back to Time Predicts and this is another reading. This, uh, these are quick messages for you. Uh, they are time, This is a timeless reading, so whenever you're hearing this reading, it applies to you. Remember, it is a general reading, but it is almost like a personal reading. If something uh, really uh, matches your situation or you get a guidance from it, I'll be really glad. So there are three piles here and I just got three numbers and I thought I have to do a reading with these three numbers. So pile, uh, uh, the first pile or whichever pile, you can choose uh, from uh, a pile which is the number four pile. You can choose the number eight for this pile and you can choose the uh, last number which is number nine for the pile I have it here. You can uh, check the timestamps in the comment section. You can go there directly. Uh, you Just see which number you're getting attracted to. If you're getting attracted to four, eight or nine whichever number you're getting attracted to please uh, pick up uh, that pile and listen to that reading you can click on the timestamp. Uh, I've got highlight of the day here let's see I've got my unicorn cards and I want to give one highlight of the day message which is uh, could be uh, could be a guidance for you for now or for later on or for the future but let's see what is the guidance for you guys remember that I am a psychic tarot reader I read my cards very differently I have not learned tarot so these are all channel messages by my spirit guides by my ascended masters and all my archangels so thank you so much everybody who listening to me uh, I would say three cards fell out but I want to take this because this is the card that really slipped out of my hand and I think this is the highlight of the day and it's a beautiful card it says laughter so lo lots of laughter coming your way your uh, life is also uh, going to be filled with laughter from a kid you know it's like either your child has just started speaking or or talking I get that also I get those messages with this card I feel your child is very uh, uh, is a very good dancer will be a very good dancer I also get the fact that the child is very graceful. I don't know why, but I get a lot of child-child energy right now. Um, I also feel good things are coming for you. So there's a lot of laughter. I feel a lot of you are going to be together with the family. Though I know it's a COVID situation, a lot of you can't get together, not more than 10 people or 5 people together. But I feel there is something to celebrate about. There is good news that's coming. And remember, like I said, I'm picking up a lot of child energy here. I think you can see the card. Your kid is really graceful. Your kid loves uh, cats also, especially cats I uh, got and uh, this is a dog I think I can't really make out right now but I, I really think that your kid loves uh, cats that's that's the feeling that I got so I'm going to put highlight of the day here and start with the unicorns blessings unicorns are magical creatures and they're always there when for us when we need them and uh, they're also here to show us the guidance so these are all mixed readings it's health romance love finance uh, whatever messages that I can get numbers names and I also got some channel messages I keep giving you channel messages uh, like I say that I read my tarot very differently so I got a lot of messages a lot of words for you guys so let's start with if you've picked up number four uh, let's see what are the messages for you remember in in 20 messages I always say 21 messages could be one messages for you or sits in your situation or you can apply it to your situation remember that it could form a story also sometimes it does form a story and it moves just around one topic you know that's what I feel but yes I'll keep telling you uh, what it is uh, as and when you know when I take out the cards and read them so this is Archangel Gabriel card it's a very beautiful card let's see what message Archangel Gabriel has for you editor you are writing or uh, your writing or other creative project benefits from outside help and support if you're uh, writing I think you can also keep a co-writer you can take someone else's help uh, the work the kind of work that you're doing the kind of creative work that you're doing I think you can uh, do with support right now I have a feeling you didn't ask for support but I also feel the channel message that I get is uh, probably you cannot uh, uh, function on your own function on your own doesn't mean anything negative it means maybe the project is so large or it is so big that you actually require somebody else's assistant or you need to hire someone to work along with you so I think you should uh, think of uh, working with someone uh, somebody has your back also somebody's going to help you out at work that's another message that I get I, I get a lot of green color in this in this uh, reading so I get uh, green uh, in this reading. <coughs> Sorry, my perpetually <laughs> throat is not well. So that's what I have to do. I hope I don't keep coughing. Less of messages and more of coughing. Sorry, guys. Let's see what's the second message if you picked up uh, the number four. It says, uh, own uh, your divine power. 
and it has come uh, it's come reversed you're not believing in yourself it's also like wanting support to believe in yourself you are going to ask for support i think uh, together uh, with someone you can do a better job of creating something this is somebody who's not well this is somebody who's uh, losing confidence that you can't do the job and you will hire someone to do the job that's another message that i get let me see what other messages that i get while i'm holding this oh. Yes, I think you need a lot of support. This group needs support. It is it is being dependent on someone. That's the message I get. Is it is it codependency? It is uh, the fear of not working well alone. I I get that. I get all those messages with this. So I think you need to uh, hire someone and you need to work with someone. That's when you'll get a get your confidence back, or you need someone to tell you to boost up your confidence that that you know uh, you're going the right way and you can handle the project. So I get some some support. This this uh, group needs some kind of a support system or wants come some kind of a support system. Let's see what are the other messages for you guys. Hope. So uh, there is love and compassion. There is hope. If you thought uh, something will not happen, but if you keep the hope, if you keep the faith, things are going to go your way. Th this is someone who's working hard to achieve things. This is somebody who's calm. So I also get the message you need to be calm. Things will happen. I think you've gotten impatient also. That's another message that I get. You got impatient uh, about waiting for someone. That's, that's another message that uh, probably it's a love situation. You think the person will not come back to you or uh, you've uh, done everything you could, you know, in your capacity to get the person back. But right now, I think uh, it's almost like losing hope. Uh, but uh, the Ascendant Masters are saying don't give up because hope keeps us going on. That's the only thing. And if you lose hope, then you lose everything. But things will uh, turn around. Things will things will be better soon. So you don't have to worry about it. So don't uh, lose hope right now. Let me see if any other. Yeah, she's holding something. It's it's also uh, you holding something very closely. You know, uh, you know, close to your heart. You don't want to leave it. That's another message that I get with these two. That's why I kept them together because I remember um, the woman, the uh, divine feminine. You know, holding something and really not wanting uh, to let go of it. I think you need to be assertive in the situation. You need to say what you feel. That's another message that I get. You you have everything going for you. It's it's you losing confidence. You know, it's like uh, you 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 are very good at your job, or you know, the love relationship is beautiful, but somewhere something is making you lose your confidence. I don't know what situation it is. That's a message I get. Let's see what are the other messages. If they actually form a story, what other messages are for this group? luxury it's wanting luxurious things from life i think you're going to buy something uh, that will me make you feel good you're going to pamper yourself that's the word i got i think you're also going to buy a house you're going to buy a bigger house or a bigger car so you've been thinking about you know buying a bigger house bigger car really indulging that's the word that's another word that i get so want, wanting wanting more from life, wanting more out of, uh, I also get wanting more out of your job. I don't know why I got this message, but I got just got this message. Getting more out of your job, wanting more out of your job. Or your job uh, helps you travel and gives you the luxuries. That's another message that I get. So you'll be traveling. Right now it's not a situation to travel, but I think you will be traveling soon. Blessings are on its way. This is a beautiful card, guys. So blessings from everybody. Blessings from the unicorns. Blessings from the archangels. So this is also a yes card for me right now. It's also a card where it says that, you know, you had a tough time, but, you know, there there is the rainbow to watch out for. You had a tough time. I don't know what, what made you lose your confidence. I'm coming back to it because that thing is bothering me when uh, the same, same cards keep coming. But I think there are better times coming you know coming ahead for you or or there's a better future for you something uh, that really uh, was important to you i could see that woman holding a lotus flower or something close in her hand you know and towards your heart you know it's almost uh, it's almost a pain that i get you know a very blunt pain that somebody hurt you or you loved your job so much either you lost it and you know you've lost your confidence with it so blessings are on its way it was it was really cloudy here 
in the beginning but it's clearing up and you can see the rainbow soon freedom yeah you've got freedoms for some from something let the unicorns set you free or oh, your heart is heavy that's why i got a blunt pain you you really um something is really important to you and you don't want to let go of it and if you, and you're finding it very difficult you know it's almost like you know um hiding hiding and thinking you know the situation is going to just pass but i also feel that you need to address something here address the situation you need to set yourself free you know how this person is bound you bound to something bound to a person that doesn't it's not really good in your life bound to a job that's not doing any good to you bound to negative thoughts there is some some kind of negativity that's really weighing upon you so i told you there's something that's really heavy in the heart you know it's really weighing you down look at all the all the uh, weight of the ball the person is tied to i i think you can see it now look at this look at the chain the person really wants to escape and there is there the, the, the doors are open the person wants to escape and i think there is freedom and i think you need freedom from something feather i think you're going to uh, you you will find a feather if when you're walking down you know uh, whatever the road you take or you know for a evening walk or i i think you'll see a white feather i get a lot of white feather and when I, whenever i say white feather i i say that your guiding spirits are nearby your angels are nearby your guardian angels are nearby and they they're going to grant the wish this calling card from the universe tells you they are near you yes of course your guardian angels are near you and they're going to leave a feather in your path that's what i get i'm sure that if you if you've chosen pile number 4 you're going to see a feather very soon yes there was deception there was deception that's why the heart is heavy that's what i get sorry for the noise la uh, from the laptop guys i don't know what's wrong with it it keeps going on its trip adjusting it yeah that's what made your heart heavy there was deception in your life and you it was it's it's very difficult for you to break away from that person or it was very difficult for you to break away from that person that's what i get detachment that's what you need no wonder the cards are matching now you need to detach yourself from the situation you need to detach yourself from the person the guy or the girl whoever you know when the, if deception has happened you need to move away from the situation you need freedom you need freedom that's when the blessings will come you need to escape i i get the word escape you need to detach you need to cut the cord that's what i get look look uh look into the future you know now don't look back that's the message that i get it's all about looking into the future what is done is done it's your past hey a lot of past is playing i don't know why a lot of past things are coming especially a relationship something that is was not right in the past so time to look forward take a step forward not backward that's what i get i don't know if air sign messed up or you are an air sign one of you i get it is an air sign or an earth sign i get air or earth that's what i feel air or earth sign i get that here things will start changing end of october remember that things will start getting better from november 28th oh sorry i i channeled that message okay so november 28th things will start getting better i wanted to say october but october i think the things will start moving for better and i think uh, the um, date that i just took or just channeled so i think that's the time really when you're going to shine that's what i get you're going to be um, feel much much better in the coming months what's gone is gone that's that's a huge message here what's gone is gone let me see what i wrote for you without even i have not seen any of these cards i just put them in the piles so i wrote group either you you were in a group either uh, you know or if i wrote group here and i said work in a group maybe you need to work in a group you cannot work alone there is something wrong with the confidence your confidence it's all 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 shaken up and i wrote strange somebody might be a stranger to you now now or could be a strange situation whatever happened starters want something for the starters or you want to start something new maybe you breaking away from the old habit starting something new i wrote make up but it could also be make up your mind now that i see this reading it's more like make up your mind not like make up make up in beauty i also got rhythm 
put your heart back in the normal rhythm i think your heartbeat is just been it's it's like dancing your heart is being going up and down up and down you know causing hurt and then leaping out almost so there has to be a rhythm to life it you need to you need to make it you know there has to be a your heart has to feel normal again that's a message that i get it's a it's touch it's done too much dancing for someone else that's a big message that i get guys so pile number 4 that was your reading i'm going to keep it away i'm going to get pile number 8 so if you've chosen uh, i'm not going to say pile number 8 but yeah if you've chosen number 8 this is a reading for you let's see pile number 4 was very different i had very different messages there it was like really different so for who uh, for whoever's chosen uh, uh, number 8 this is this is just a laughter card this is a uh, highlight of the day laughter card where love laughter is going to come in the family you're going to laugh a lot or you love you love laughing we just did see a comedy show i don't know why about that again now <laughs> you you uh, saw something that really made you laugh out loud or there's somebody in your life that really uh, makes you laugh and you love that you love uh, that quality about them that they can actually make you laugh and dance and sing look at this card it's so beautiful Let's see uh, if you've chosen number eight. What messages are for you? I've also channeled some messages, and I've kept them for all the three numbers. I've kept some words. I haven't seen the pile because I just shuffled and made three piles. So let's see if the words match in the pile in the number four. It did. So let's see what are the messages. Allow yourself to receive. Need to be more open. Don't close yourself. Don't close yourself to thoughts, people, new jobs, new opportunities. It's a time to receive. If you manifested anything, it's a time it will come true. I don't know why, but I get a lot of blue color here. I don't know if you're a water sign, but I get a lot of blue here. I also get that you're wearing green when you're listening to this reading. That's another thing I pick up. Some some prayer is going to be answered. If you did pray for something and you were listening to this reading and you chose number eight, whatever you prayed for will be answered. I think you prayed for something last night. So whenever you're listening to this reading. and when you if you play prayed for something last night i, I think it's going to come true be more open hearted be more open hearted listen to people that's another uh, that's another uh, thing that i get that you got to uh, be open to people you got to listen more i feel you talk more you you need to listen more to people they're trying to say something to you you've gotten close to someone someone close to you you want to close to someone close to you so you got to listen to them they're telling you the right thing remember these are general guidances guys it's not that all messages are meant for you could be some you can pick up a few whatever are resonating with you or your situation life changing experience and it's come reverse so something will happen life changing only when you can when you open and receive there is something really great going to happen that's what i get something big something great but will happen only when you open up otherwise that's why this card is reversed great things are going to happen but you're not receiving them this this group is seemingly about all opening up you know when you open up there'll be so many experiences that you can experience so so many things you can see that you've not seen before or the new ways of seeing you know I told you open communication. There, this 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 one is falling into one pattern. Like the other one also had an overriding theme. This one is also having no overriding theme. You're not ready to receive any information. You are so closed. You got to open the communication. You got to open your communication channel. You have to allow yourself to receive. You have to listen. I think you're doing all the talking. That's why you're not getting you're not getting the right answers. You need to listen to the other person. This is this is Gemini. This is totally Gemini. I told you air sign. I think when I started this, I told you it's an air sign, and this is Gemini, guys. Mercury is Gemini. You have to open your channel of communication. It's a very one-way channel with you right now. You're not open. You're not listening to anybody. What's that about? It says get a weight off your chest. You need to talk about it. If you, if something is bothering you, if you don't talk, it won't. Uh, you know, it won't come out. The weight won't be lifted off from your chest. you carrying a lot of heavy load on your chest speak up with love and be heard so don't just say things for the uh, you know sake of saying it i think if you've had a tiff you're just talking 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 you're not making sense right now 
you got to say the right things i think you need to communicate with someone that will really change your life you've not you're not open air signs i don't know why this is you or you're dealing with an air sign i think air signs this is you you're not dealing with the air sign but i feel this is you clock clock of uh, sorry cloak of wisdom you already know the answer you seek trust what you know so trust what you know you know the answers within you just have to tell them you need to speak up you need to tell them what you know you need to tell people what you know or probably there's a secret that you know and you have to uh, say it out it will help someone that's another message that i get you got to talk it out that's another message you got to talk it out somebody is waiting for you to talk somebody is waiting eagerly for you to talk because they want to know what what you thinking then only will you get resolution see it says resolution resolution is on its way the things are going to be okay but you need to talk you need to communicate i can see dolphins and i can see whale dolphins communicate very well so you need to communicate with someone you love you need to communicate with your bosses you need to open the channels of communication you been so close people don't understand if you understand it or not or if you what do you think what are your feelings you've got it so hidden i also get the fact that you've got everything so hidden in the depths of the you know ocean you need to communicate with your own kind that's another message forming some kind of a community or something that's the time when you can have you know a res- you can uh, have an outcome of the situation if you don't talk how will how will people know what's in your mind you're going to transform something is going to make you transform something is waiting for transformation you're going to change something transformation i'm also getting a moving a house or moving a place of residence that is her house i don't uh, see moving too far away from the place you are residing right now but i see a movement here this is not a movement card guys i told you i read my cards very differently from whatever channel messages i get so there will be change coming up for you that's what i get only when you um, communicate and talk i also get you love sunflowers i don't know why but something about sunflowers really uh, fascinates you i told you perspective your your way of looking at things and the other people's way of looking at things is very different guys you're looking at a thing with a certain view point and you're almost wanting to fight the others are looking at a little handshake and a negotiation this is you this is how you thinking a tussle a fight but people want you to negotiate so if you're not talking they don't understand you at all what do you want from the situation examine your situation from a higher perspective you got to open up you got to open up your eyes that's another message you got to open up your eyes guys you got to see things differently you wanting to retreat in a situation wanting to step back wanting to disconnect you wanted to disengage that's those are the words that's why you're not being communicated you actually uh seeing the situation from a very different uh, uh you have a very different point of view on this or the other person and you are not on the same page the person is seeing the situation very differently you are seeing the situation very differently that's why you guys need to talk if you if it's your job or family any any problem in the family or or love situation you guys are not talking to each other you're not even explaining what's wrong that's the problem that's the whole problem expression of course this this reading is falling in place you need to express yourself if you don't express what's the use So you're ready to manifest your thoughts and transform them into acts of love. You got to express yourself. You're not been telling how you feel. The other person has no idea. The other person feels that you're totally disconnected from them. You're stepping back. Their perspective is not matching yours. You're thinking something else, and you're thinking they'll understand. They're thinking you're thinking on uh, something else, and you'll meet at a common ground. But there's no common ground. You you two are not on the same page. I'm telling you guys. the delays delays are happening that's why the delays are happening nobody is saying uh, whatever is the problem whatever is the situation nobody is talking of course there'll be delays king of pentacles with this i feel you're going to lose your position if you talk that's what you feel 
your ego is coming in the way something about the ego here you know you 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 don't want to give in into the situation i think neither of you are wrong but it you you are more egoistic you're not telling the other person what's wrong you know you feel you lose your position the higher ground that you've taken that you think you've tra- taken are you you being you being good and not talking and wondering if other person the other person understands that you're doing something good or whatever whatever you're doing for the other person the other person has no inkling doesn't know anything you're not expressing you're not saying that's what i think you need to talk to the other person don't worry you're not going to lose your position or dignity or respect those are the words that i get you got to talk you got to keep ego aside let's see what the words i got for you number 8 i wrote rejoice renew result you need to renew something when you renew something you're going to rejoice and that's when you get the result i also got the word uh, the letter b for you the alphabet b i don't know what it means but yeah it could be important for you could be a place of residence could be where you live your name anything your lover's name your job name anything from b is important for you so this is how it's going to flow it's you got to renew something that's the time you can rejoice and that's the time results will show so that was your reading if you chose number 8 let me see what is number 9 So I'm going to move on to number nine. Number nine, we're going to do a reading for you. Remember, this is a general reading, uh, not a specific one. I've got the guide, uh, the highlight of the day uh, message for you, which is laughter. So uh, a lot of laughter is going to come your way. You're going to laugh. Uh, you're going to make someone laugh. That's the channel message for you guys. You're going to make someone laugh, or someone is going to make you happy. Or is going to crack a joke. You've not been talking, so that's how normally the other person gets you. uh gets your mood right probably they crack a joke and that's what makes you feel better so that's i think a beautiful thing to do but it is about laughter it's laughter coming your way being being happy i also get the i also get the channel message a message that you're going to be happy after a long time number 9 if you chose a number 9 this pile happy after a long time want very really happy laughter is going to you know fill fill your life now let's see what are your messages express your inner truth you're not talking about what is in deep inside you because this card came reverse and i'm going to read it that way you're not telling people what's wrong with you your friends want to hear from you also not talking much to your friend i get the words recluse here you you become reclusive you become a loner you had a lot of friends what happened you given that group up you want to uh, just uh, be away from someone something happened someone misunderstood you that's the word that i get another word i feel when you work with other people or when you talk is really you know when you feel happy this is all about being with people you 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 love telling jokes i don't know why i get this because i was talking you know i get different messages always from what the cards are So I feel you laughing, really, really laughing on a joke someone told you. You're going to tell someone a joke, or you did tell someone a joke. You really know how to make the person feel better, you know, like do a kind of a comedy act or something. Something is funny that you do, and you make the other piece person feel better. Sorry for the noise from the laptop; it's gone crazy again. So right now you had a lazy time. Not much was coming your way. You were worried about some projects. on uh, wasn't uh, recently there was not too much work to do and you didn't really feel nice because you love doing a lot of things together and you you crave for that you like doing a lot of things and uh, right now it's like uh, when when will more work come our way i think that's that's the kind of feeling that i get from this card wanting more work is like almost asking for work Or maybe this is this is just a lull before the storm. That's that's the kind of rest you've given yourself. You've been working like crazy. Be join join a community. It will make you feel good. Like I said, you know, you're feeling reclusive and you know really wanting to be alone, not wanting to be a part of others, or not wanting sorry, wanting to be a part of a group. I want you to I want you to join a group if you can. it'll make you feel better i don't know why but i feel you almost thought of joining a laughter club did it was it is it true you'll feel better if you are with people and you and you should be with people i don't know why i get this with number 9 you have to be with people right now and they will show you the right way or it's about counseling is it is it that you need to consult someone for 
for something new that you're starting and you need a lot of people's advice i'm getting that message also i'm just channeling that message that you need to know people you need to have connections you want to get to know people so also also people wanting to tell you you know uh, how to go about it some kind of a tip that you were seeking for some more knowledge that you're seeking for how to run a business or probably something new or maybe a new job that you want to take I get Lady Nada, heart awakening. Your heart is going to awaken. Somebody new is coming in your life. Somebody is going to make you laugh. Somebody is going to make you feel really loved. That's a beautiful reading. Somebody is going to give you roses or, or a perfume which smells like roses or the name is very similar or calls you a rose. I don't know why I got that. Awaken to acceptance and divine love. Give and receive in balance. So it's also if your love situation has been out of balance, one person giving a lot, the other person just taking, 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 I think it's going to balance it out. The situation is just going to be a balance. There's going to be a, you know, equal give and take. There's going to be a beautiful relationship or if there was any fight, any problem, I think it's going to be fine. You know, it's going to be balanced again. That's, that's the message that I get. I think, I think you like, uh, you, I think you like light here, light brown here. Or the person you're going around with, uh, you okay. like light brown hair of them. Or probably the person has light brown hair. That's not the message that I get. Yes, embrace. It's new love. Somebody new coming in your life. That's why there is a love awakening. If you've cho chosen this uh, pile, there is somebody new coming in your life. And that's beautiful. Look at the love there. It's, it's, it's embrace, it says embrace and a very solid relationship. It's going to be a very grounded relationship. One of you will be an earth sign. That's what I feel. I get earth and fire a lot here. Yes, you're going to find the one who will commit. I feel that it's going to be a very serious relationship coming up soon. I get soon also here. That's really great. Yes, you've been manifesting. You've been following a ritual. You like manifesting late at night. You like manifesting around 1 o'clock at night. That's what I feel. Or probably you chant something around 1 o'clock at night. You've been asking for this. You've been asking for your love. That's what I feel. You've been really thinking about the person. You've been waking up at night. You've been awake at night and thinking about the person a lot. I get a lot of brown hair. Either you have light brown hair or the person you're going around with or, or going to get married or going to get into a committed relationship will have will have light brown hair. That's that's the message. It's a very big message that I get. The person also, has, you have a healing touch. Whoever's chosen this pile, I get a healing touch from here, you know. You're also a medium. I also get being a medium. I also feel you play drums or you like the drums. Or you like listening to the drums or the person you go around with or somebody in your house. You know, you like just, you know, when you're idle and you just play play the drums or just drum, probably drum your fingers. Maybe you have that habit. That's another message that I get. Also feel that you like, like working with clay. You also love red color. I get a lot of red color in this. I also feel that you put a lot of tea lights, you know, in your house. You, you like it that way. A lot of lights, candles, that's how you keep your house and that's what really pleases you. I get a lot of red, red, red candles, red color. Archangel Uriel, become a peace ambassador. So you need to uh, make a situation peaceful or probably two friends are fighting and you got to get peace, make peace there. You're going to act as a referee between two people is what I get. Or in a situation, you need, you'll be needed in a situation. Your friends will need you, you know, to take a decision. Don't take any side because I, f I also get the message, be fair in the judgment. There has to be a fair judgment. And somebody's going to ask you for your advice. That's what I get. Or has already asked you. So just be fair to both the parties. That's, that's the message that I get. I get you're a healer. I don't know why, but you heal people. That's what I feel. I feel you have very soft hands, and your hands normally stay warm, and, and you heal people. That's that's a big message that I'm getting. 
express your love go ahead and make the romantic gesture so a lot of romance cards in this in this uh, pile that's really beautiful there's something new that's just started you're going to you're going to really be close to each other there's a lot of passion that i can see in the in these cards there's a lot of love it's going to start with a lot of passion attraction there will be a commitment you will express your uh, true feelings to each other very soon you know sometimes you take a uh, long the courtship period is long but i i don't know i like i i feel like you know you met and you know there's a lot of attraction you get engaged you've expressed yourself you get engaged you get married i get all those things yeah that's what i feel very close to someone really you really you're really attracted to someone and so is the other person attracted to you as much as you are let's see what are the other messages love message commitment i told you guys commitment is coming this is all about love this is a beautiful reading this is all about love expressing yourself finding love heart awakening opening uh, opening uh, your uh, door opening the door of your house to someone new or opening the door of your life to someone new love life it's a new relationship even if it's a little old relationship there is commitment in it guys you guys are going to commit to each other or you've already committed to each other yep the emperor and i get the empress together you make the person feel like a king you really make the person feel nice the other person makes you feel like a queen you're also going to be partners it's either going to be business or job you're going to be partners in some way you know you go to start something together or you met at the same place and I, i and i get also i get the message that your parents are going to agree for the marriage even if it's a love marriage arranged naturally but yeah you love making money you love making money money gives you that power that's another message that i get you feel powerful with money The other message I also get is don't let money come in the way of your love life. That's another message that I want to give. If money is coming in between, don't whatever that means to you. So I channel some messages for number nine. If you chose by number nine, and I and I wrote migrate. So you're going to migrate. Maybe you're getting married and you're moving somewhere. You're going to measure something. Somebody needs to measure up to you. You're going to measure something. You're measuring something either to make from wood or something similar. A measuring cloth. I also get measuring cloth. I don't know if you're in fashion designing, but I get measuring cloth also. Now I get that something powerful will happen, or you feel powerful. Like I said, you feel powerful with money, or money gives you that power. You're gonna step down from a position. I don't know what position you wanna step down, but yes, you're gonna step down from something, or probably step back. That's another thing I want to say. You wanna take a step back. It's not gonna be bad for you. It's a good thing. but you're going to step down for peace okay you want to make peace in the situation you're probably going to step down that's another message yes that's why this message came probably you need to you need to step away or step down for it for the situation to be peaceful again that's that's the message that i got yeah so thank you so much for uh, listening to the reading do like my channel do hit the like button do comment or always reply on the comment do write what kind of reading do you want also do write which pile did you pick up and also do always come back and write what came true and what did you resonate with also hit hit the bell uh, notification uh, button so you know when i upload a video and you can hear it first and you know when i'm uploading it so thank you so much take care and i'll be back with another reading soon bye guys thank you so much